the snake tribe written by w w e rose now let's read the poem and explain it in detail the snake trying to escape the pursuing stick with sudden curvings of thin long body how beautiful and graceful are his shapes in these lines the poet says that the snake tries to escape from being hit by the stick that is following it as the snake crawls its long body twists and turns forming fascinating shapes now let's continue the poem he glides through the water away from the stroak or let him go over the water into the reeds to hide without hurt small and green he is harmless even to children in this continuation of the previous lines the poet says the snake moves to the water in order to save itself and the poet pleads to let it escape and hide behind the thick marshy plants as it is harmless the small green colored snake is harmless even to children let's get into the concluding lines of the poem along the sand he lay until observed and chased away and now he vanishes in the ripples among the green slim reeds in this concluding lines the poet says till the snake was spotted and chased away by the person holding a stick the snake lay quietly in the sand it is in order to save itself the snake disappears in the ripples of the water and hides in the camouflaging green bushes of the marshy plants now let's observe the literary devices used in this poem it is clear from the lines that the poem is written in free verse from these lines we can see the phrase pursuing stick it is a transferred epithet the word pursuing is an adjective it is used before the noun stick actually pursuing refers to the person who is holding the stick here and not the stick itself so we can say this phrase is a transferred epithet finally the poet has made use of the device alliteration it is the repetition of a consonant sound in two or more consecutive words in this poem the poet has used alliteration in the line he is harmless the sound h is repeated in this line now we can solve the textual questions question number 1 what is the snake trying to escape from answer the snake is trying to escape from the person who is chasing it with a stick and is trying to hit it second question is it a harmful snake and what is its color answer the snake is harmless and it is green in color next question the poet finds the snake beautiful find the words he uses to convey its beauty answer the words used here to describe the snake are beautiful and graceful next one what does the poet wish for the snake answer the poet wishes that the snake saves itself another question where was the snake before anyone saw it and chased it away and where does the snake disappear answer 
before it was seen the snake was lying in the sand and the snake disappears behind the marshy plants